What's going on guys? Sean Basketball Cards back with another video today. Um, I'm a little under the weather, so my voice isn't going to be great for this one, but this is going to be my first upload uh, in a while. Been away at school. This is uh, my upload tomorrow as well. We'll see. But this is just going to be some pickups that I made off eBay recently. Um, I got a big Com C order in too, so I'll make a video about that. And then I also have a uh, a PSA submission coming back soon, so I should have some content coming out, but I'll just get started with this. Only got like 10 cards here. Won't be a super long video, but we'll get started. The first one is a card that I think is pretty cool. Um, Players Club Platinum Jordan from Collector's Choice. These are pretty rare parallels, you know, there's something like 3,000 per card odds. Um, there's a few Jordans in the set, but you know, for pack rarity, and I actually like the parallel too, so it's it's fairly cheap. You can get them for under $100. Um, yeah, I, I really like this one. I like to go after the, the really rare inserts for Jordan and, and try and find ones that I think undervalued, and, and that's one that I really like. Um, and then I actually already have one of these graded, but this is a Topps Gold Label, Black Label Jordan. The parallel's up there with the uh, the Black Label. Um, I really like this one. I got this for really cheap at auction, like basically half off what they sell for. And uh, these aren't necessarily the rarest ones, but I really, really like these. Just simple, good looking cards. So, yep, really, really like that Jordan. Um, and then next up, I've been picking up a ton of John Wall. I mean, it's my favorite player ever, my PC. So, have a lot of him here. And, and that's basically the comps you order too when that video comes out. Uh, I've actually got this one up. Facebook for pretty cheap. This is a early select John Wall jersey auto. Numbered to 20. Pretty low number there. Like that. And yeah, it's just another auto. I think I have three of them now. Um, yeah, and I'm always in the market for, for low number John Wall stuff. Been picking up uh, a ton of that. So yeah, really like that one. And I got that again, like I said, for super cheap. It was just way too good of a deal to pass up. Uh, next up is a pretty interesting one. I actually have, like, a regular one of these that I bought from, you know, over five years ago. Just something I got when I was a kid. And I saw this come for auction, and I just thought it was so cool. This uh, really, really nice three-color patch. Not something you see. It's, it's not numbered, so a highly printed jersey card just getting a sick patch like that I think is, is really cool. Um, it's a, it's a nice Rockets one too. This is from when he was on the Raptors, but it's clearly a, a Rockets game worn jersey, so that's really cool. And the game worn part nowadays, that's tough to come by. This next card's pretty cool. Um, again, I won this for cheap at auction. Um, this I believe is a case at parallel of Clyde. It's from uh, this year's Obsidian. It's like Blue Flood. I just think it's a really really nice looking card. Um. Reminds me of, of 14, 15 Prism. That's one of my favorite sets when, you know, the parallels would be the entire card. And yeah, I, I really like this one. It's a great looking card. Like I said, I think it's a case it's so pretty rare. And uh, yeah, really nice one there. Uh, then I got this Zebra. I've been in the mark for a Tiger Prism, but the Select Zebra is basically the same thing. And yep, got this at auction off eBay. Pretty cool one. Um, I'm trying to get as many unique wall cards as I can. Anything, you know, low numbered case hit, SSP, whatever. Low numbered rookies, you know, those those kind of things. And yeah, I just uh, been picking up a lot of this. So that's really cool in there. Uh, only a couple more cards here. I think they're all wall. This is, uh, so this just looks like a hyper from Optic. And that might be why I was able to get it for, for so low at auction, but it's the Lucky Envelope, numbered to eight, two of eight jersey number, really cool. I've been looking to get a Lucky Envelope card, not just a wall, but in general, players I like, just, I mean, they're super low numbered. Obviously, if you don't know the Lucky Envelope, you get two cards, they're both numbered to eight. So, you're guaranteed those two super short print cards, but they still are only numbered to eight, really rare, and... I do like the look of them. I mean, this isn't the best one. It just looks like an optic hyper, but yeah, it's jersey number two of eight. Great card. 
And then this card, I got, it was labeled as just the base. Um, but obviously if, you know, when it says Prism on the back, it's it's a silver. And this is first year select. So this is a, this is actually a pretty solid card here. And I paid, you know, like four or five bucks for it. It's only like maybe $20, $25, but first year select silver. Great card. You get some of the nicer players like Curry or LeBron. You're talking thousands of dollars there and and yeah, this uh this wall is pretty cool. Um I would love to get a, a first year prism, but that's ridiculous even for wall. And then last up here, last card for this video, this uh select pink. Nothing crazy, but low numbered to twenty. Like I said, that's what I've <clears throat> been going after for wall. Is just the uh the lower numbered stuff. But that'll do it for this video. Uh, please leave a like, subscribe. Not sure how good this will do. I've been uh, not uploading for about a month, so hopefully this does well. I'm going to try and upload a couple of videos here. So yeah, thanks for watching.